Hello friends, it's me. Today we're watching TikToks that only girls are supposed to understand. To see if I understand them. People think it's a filter, but... Wait, what? I thought she peeled off her skin for a second. I, this happens once a month. The ladies be shedding like snakes. Just brand new skin every month. We just built different. For a moment, I thought I wasn't wearing leggings. Oh, I thought the same thing for a hot second and then when the jacket went up, I saw somebody at the gym wearing these the other day. Nude leggings. I saw her in one of the mirrors and I'm like, oh, that lady don't have pants on. So I saw her cheeks out. And then I took a closer look and I'm like, oh, they just leggings. Nude colored leggings. These are not the vibe. Putting all my hair in the front. The back. <laughs> hey, you gotta pick one. I got a nasty part in the back of my hair. Me, when I record videos, I just care about the front of my hair. I don't care about the back. Sometimes I'll literally just straighten like the front of my hair. All I need is like two strands in the front, put on a beanie. It's a lot of work to have perfect hair if you weren't naturally blessed with it. My hair is always either a mess, greasy, dirty, or frizzy. I can't win. POV, a booty hole cramp, just 360, no scope, your soul. <laughs> uh, what? It feels like lightning just struck your back door. If that's what you're talking about. You know, growing up, I thought there was just something wrong with me whenever I just feel pain randomly. But I guess we all just be living the same life. No experience is unique. When you get home and can finally take your bra off. <laughs> Those things are aerodynamic. The way they're just... A skill I wish I had. Ain't nothing in this world like coming home, pop off your boob prison, put on some PJ pants, let the mommy milkers free. Pants cause a, a woman to act masculine. Women today do not know how to sit like a lady or to act modestly because of their pants. <sighs> they no longer bend at the knees, but they bend at the waist, exposing their chest. What? Who was narrating this? They no longer bend at the knees, but they bend at the waist, exposing their chest. Bro talking about women like it's a laptop. How do pants make you masculine? You know you can bend your legs normally with pants? I literally lost brain cells watching this. I am revoking your privilege to ever talk about a female on a podcast ever again. Pre-dinner. Post-dinner. It do be like that though. Some people just like hella bloat. Me included. I and mean, that's what the button in your pants is for. That's why they call it a food baby. Looking like you're pregnant but it's just all you can eat breadsticks. But you don't look like you're in a cars. But you don't look gay. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me just. <laughs> now do I look like I'm into cars? <laughs> that cannot be her uniform. She looks a little. Hmm, I heard you're into cars. Name every single car ever made. <laughs> gamer girl versus yeah. gamer girl. <laughs> I mean, when you just gaming at home versus when you gaming on Twitch, I just be like that though. What are you doing tonight? Come over. I can't, I don't have any gas. <laughs> She's driving a Tesla. It's an electric car, there's no gas. You know what, that is a valid excuse when you don't wanna go anywhere or do anything. I ain't got no gas. Uh, they don't need another, my car doesn't actually need any. Okay, but what happens when there's a power outage? You can't charge your car, also valid. If your hair stands up by itself, it's dead. No. Oh, that's kind of cute. An anime characters have this. It's called an ahoge, which literally means foolish hair. It's like that little strand that doesn't want to conform to society's norms. And it's very cute. I don't think it means the hair is dead. Otherwise, my whole head would be standing up. Since boys think they know everything, what are these? I'm worried I'm not gonna know what it is. Oh. <laughs> Simple, really. Any guys watching this? What do you think that is? A secret device? You know, I'm not even gonna say anything. Comment below. Let me know what you think these are. And if any guys know what they are, I will be just a little bit impressed. If your girlfriend don't have the motivation to work out, try this. Is that Mar? I mean, that's one way to force yourself to do a plank. Line up all your most expensive lipsticks and you will be forced to plank upon them. Yeah, planks are good for you. I can never plank more than a minute though. Everybody has this mirror. And you need to be destroyed! And that mirror, that's the skinny mirror. I have one of these and every time somebody comes over, they're like, is it just the mirror or do I really look this good? And some mirrors just built different. Which one you trust in? The $10 Walmart mirror or the $12 Target mirror? I'm gonna decide to trust the mirror that I look good in. When your parents come home early and you're not done playing single mom simulator. Um, excuse me, what the actual f are you doing in my house? <laughs> what are you doing in my house? 
I just want to bake cookies for my three kids. Y'all ruining this. When your man won't talk to you, so you gotta give him reasons to. And by reasons, I mean hiding things that he would be looking for. You're gonna need your shoes. Let me just... And then he gonna walk up to the mat and be like, where did my shoes go? They were just here. Are all guys the same? You can literally just... Oh, the remote is right here. I'm going to put it right here. Oh no, where is the remote? Honey, have you seen the remote? You know, the protein where you can clearly see it? Let's just rotate it. <laughs> He'll never be able to find it. Shaker cup? Move it to another counter where he would least expect it. Oh, toothpaste. You're gonna need that, right? Let's just put it behind here. Oh, he'll never notice because he's used to it being in the front. Some of y'all helpless for real. I love helping my boyfriend shave. <laughs> Ayo, what was that? The sound. <laughs> hey, what fell in the toilet though? Y'all ever notice these hand dryers? Called the Dyson Airblade. They look the curler. So people are like putting their hair in these. Is it supposed to curl it? That ain't do much. That kind of just tangled it into a knot. Also, I don't know about you guys, but these things are filthy. I would not be putting my hair inside there. Somebody on TikTok did an experiment. A public hand dryer has so many germs around it. So it's like you just wash your hands, they're clean, and it basically just blasts germy air. It's more hygienic to just like, Air dry your hands and like use an air dryer. And when you get your coochie meow meow sugared and the esthetician gives you a sugar wax like popsicle. A is that a thing? I mean, it's just sugar and lemon juice. They just give it to you it's to like, like eat. I'm sure they don't give you the wax with the hair on it. It is like a reward. When I get asked for an eyebrow tutorial, I don't know how to respond because I mean, just look. Hey, that was quick. I ain't never seen anyone do their eyebrows like this before. Oh, that was the quickest eyebrow tutorial I have ever seen. Just a jit and a jit. And like using the side of the pencil, I ain't never seen this done. What's taking you so long to get ready? What do you mean? Hold on, let me draw my eyebrows on. <sighs> it's gonna take forever. Her, one, two, three, four. Four seconds and eyebrows done. When you let a guy buy you a drink and now he's sticking beside you. <laughs> Ooh, why is this filter so accurate? Bro keep trying to get closer, do a little dancey dance. And you just like, stop, nah. I'm just here for the free drink and that's it. Go on, skedaddle. You ain't getting nothing but a thanks from me. When the watery soap keeps running down your elbow while doing your skincare routine. It's not the vibe, stop! This is literally so annoying. No matter how specific, I can't believe we have the same problems. I'm just trying to wash my face in peace. And then somehow the water always wanna roll down my arm. If you are wearing a sweater, this is a problem. Even if you roll it all the way up to here, the sleeves will still end up getting wet. I must take off my entire sweater. Must be sleeveless to be able to wash my face in peace. Never realized self-timer flash picks in the bathroom could turn out this good. Dang, those are good. Those are like professional. <laughs> nah. This is the more realistic result. I don't know how you get pictures these good. Like, is somebody taking these with a professional camera, with a flash? Maybe you got a ring light. But if I set up a tripod and took pictures, they would be something like this. <laughs> Not all bathrooms are created equally. Some people are just really good at photography. Other people, yeah, that's me. Telling my boss I have COVID to go to LA. Sorry, I can't come to work. <coughs> I'm sick. Anyways, you think your boss is not gonna find out? Hey Brenda, how you doing? Why is he texting me? Hi, I'm doing a little better. COVID treating you good? So you're scheduled to come back in two days? What do you mean come back in two days? She has COVID. She gonna need at least a week off. About that, I don't think I'll be able to come in. I still have a fever and lots of cough. Really? Sore throat, high temperature, headaches. Yeah, what are you naming all my symptoms for? Weirdo. Yeah, it's been a horrible week. How was it horrible? Your gram story looks lively. Uh-oh, she didn't block him. You know, this is why you post things to close friends. OMG, LOL, that was from weeks ago. That's a good save. Oh, really? I'm sure you're resting in bed and very tired. Do you not believe me? Why would I lie about having COVID? Even though I just did. Of course not, I believe you. It's just that your iCloud must be acting up. Says you're at Chiquit's bar. Oh no, I left my iCloud on my work computer. You know, everything that could possibly go wrong went wrong in this situation and it's time to admit that you're caught. Give me a sec, I'll get right back to you. Uh oh, he calling. He never calls me, I'm fired! Well, this is awkward. What's even more awkward is when he finds his TikTok. Yeah, you losing that job. Hello, friends.
friends, it's me. And today we're checking out some TikToks that only girls are supposed to understand. So boys, this video might make zero sense to you. And I'm gonna try my best to explain what I can, if I even understand these. So I was sending pictures like this to a guy and he was like, oh, what's under your blanket? So I sent him this <laughs> and I took a video and I was like, <laughs> another blanket, mother Wow, girls are always gonna troll you when guys ask to send a pic. Okay, so this video is for like all the short girls, so if you're not one of them, just like keep scrolling, okay? <laughs> Stop taking all the tall guys. I'm 6'3". I want to have D1 athlete children, so please, um, leave them to me. Thank you. Oh, she said it. She said it. One of my friends asked, where are all the tall guys at? I'm like, they're happily married with all the short girls. She's 6'3". She need one. How girls be when they walk downstairs. How girls be when they run. How girls be when they take off the bra and lay down on the bed. <laughs> Boom. How girls be when they walk downstairs. I felt that. It's funny, it's kind of embarrassing. I was kind of doing that in front of the mirror the other day. I was doing that like anime running meme. Almost done. Slap myself in the face. Just kidding, they're not that big. <laughs> Guys be like, I want a thick girl with a nice big butt and a nice pair of tatas until we sit down and realize that we kind of look like the Buddha statue and then the second they see our gut when we sit, they kick us to the curb. You can't have a butt without a little bit of gut. So get that through your head. <laughs> she right, she right. It's like you can when you're standing up, <coughs> me, and then as soon as I eat something, get comfy, sit down. Y'all want a butt, there gonna be some gut. When he shaves his beard. <laughs> dad for your hands. Now you figure out how to break it off because you're not marrying an eight year old. Go calm down, it's not that deep. Thankfully, it grows back. The first few times Evan did that, I'm like, I like look at him, I'm like, you did this, why? How could you do this? Like, do they not realize they look like 10 times better with beards? And instead it was bothering him. It gets hot, it gets itchy. Ugh. Me, turns on mic. Are you a girl? What's your snap? Will you be my Fortnite GF? Okay, you see, those aren't that bad. Even to this day, I hate turning on my mic unless it's absolutely necessary. Or it's the end of the game and I'm trying to roast my team. Unmute real quick. Y'all are hot trash. Exit. Man, every time I'm trying to talk strats, it's just like, wait, is there a girl in the lobby? Nah, dude, that's Sniper Wolf. Let's confuse the guys. I'm gonna try not to get confused. When you don't have any. Oh, I, I know what you did there. I know what you guys are smuggling in your sleeves. The quick fold. <laughs> Basically, if you need some coochie cotton. <laughs> I really just made that up on the spot. Your friends, they got you. And they will go out of their way so that no high school boy will ever know what they look like. To the girl sitting beside me in the bathroom stall opening really slowly opening her maxi pad. Baby, listen, I know you ain't opening no bag of chips. Go on, open that maxi pad, slap it in them panties and get out so I can fart. <laughs> okay, that's real good. People at school really be doing that. I think I was one of those people, I apologize, that like slowly open up their pad. Like I can't let any of these other females know. Newsflash, they all know. Nobody is gonna be like, ew. Everyone does it. Let's confuse the boys. Hard edition. Effort. Honesty. Empathy. Respect. Hey, that's not all, guys. Don't just loop them in, put them in one big square. Let's confuse the boys. Kotex. Ultra thin. Playtex. Argon YC. Maxi. I think everyone knows what a maxi is. And we ain't talking about a dog. <laughs> Let's confuse the boys. Sheet. Clay. Charcoal. Oh, I know exactly what she's talking about. The gel. Sleep. I actually know that one. Sleep. Oh, I did actually hit my camera on the face. We good? Let me put in my hair. Intense thinking. Those ponytail thoughts be hidden different. Not even the ponytail thoughts, but just like that spacing out thought. Just like sitting there and just doing some tedious. Thinking about things that you shouldn't be thinking about and get back to work. Okay, there's no way I'm the only person who constantly wears sweatshirts and sweatpants and oversized t-shirts, forgets they have a body, and then they actually put on real clothes for once, and they're like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's me, I'm actually hot. <laughs> this is me all winter. And then when you finally dress up, it's like, oh, there she is. Girl, don't matter what you wear, you a queen. She uses me for her teeth. She uses me for her eyebrows. Wait, who is that? That brush. Wait, what? 
She used me for her teeth. She used me for her eyebrows. She used the brush for her hair, right? Am I missing something? Yeah. Y'all get real comfortable on this app. <laughs> Uh, okay. Smash like if you get it. <laughs> Girls, let's confuse the boys. Where is she going? Oh, she getting a towel. You know, that took me a hot second. Yes, every girl or every household has that one red towel. Certain things show up on other colored towels, but not red. So now you know. Only girls will understand this. Me after sitting down the whole lesson. Wait, what? Does she have swamp butt? Oh! It took me a second. Yeah. <laughs> that happens. And then it feels like you peed yourself. Oh, don't even get me started about when you sneeze. So like yesterday, I was on the verge of having like a mental breakdown and I wanted to like cry like a million freaking times. But like, I couldn't. You wanna know why? Cause I just got my lashes done and you have to wait 48 hours before getting them wet. <laughs> <laughs> I've never related so much to a TikTok. I get my lashes done. It's like you gotta wait at least like 24 hours before getting them wet. So like you can't cry and ruin them cause that's a $60 fill out the window. Where's my pants a few times? Why does this happen? This is a real issue. Lululemon leggings are very susceptible to this. It just mean you got some thick thighs and they like to rub against each other. And then you got this $100 legging ruined. Wow. They were fake. Of course they were fake. Wait, is it only girls that have fake pockets? Do you guys not have fake pockets? Y'all got those nice, deep, secured pockets. We got nothing but a flap of lies. Why do they do that? Oh, it's a female. They'll have a bag. I really think that's the logic behind it. Miss Walker, can I go to the bathroom? Yes, Amber, go ahead. Okay, I'll be right back. Why are you bringing your backpack with you? That's disgusting. I'm sorry you haven't hit puberty yet, Leah, but I don't want to walk in the hallways with this. Did she just say Leah? How does she know? I'm sorry you haven't hit puberty yet, Leah. This has never happened to me, but it's happened to other girls that I went to school with and guys used to call them out. Like, why are you bringing your backpack? And I never really paid any attention to it, but yeah, ain't nobody trying to whip out a pad and walk on down, let everybody know. Remember when you were 15 and you need to put on drugstore makeup and straighten your hair for two hours just to have an average looking boy who's failing health ignore you at the high school football game? Ooh. That hurted. Yes! <laughs> Man, I had the lowest standards in school and they still didn't like me back. Just because us 4'11 to 5'3 girls are short does not mean you need to bully 25'8. If this is true, people are really finding an excuse to bully over everything. I never seen anybody be bullied for being 5'3, what? Unless y'all on a school of giants or something. Me walking somewhere and seeing a ton of girls. Them. Ugh, me and my anxiety. And that on insecurity. Loki, this used to be me several years ago. I feel like when I was first in a relationship, I always used to be like that when I go out with my boyfriend and I would just be like, why are there so many girls here? Is he looking at them? You think they're prettier than me. But it's like I'm grown now. You can't be like comparing other girls to yourself. She's prettier than me. Oh, my self-esteem ruined. But it's like now I say a pretty girl, I'm like, dang, she pretty. And then I move on with my day. Completely forget about it. Who cares? It's over. I don't know. Maybe it's something you just like grow out of because you got old now perks of dating a 5-1 girl she'll always need your help reaching things in opening jars she makes the perfect cuddle partner you can throw her around in the bedroom she'll beat you in every hide and seek game okay you don't have to flex on us 5-4 girls that hard we get it you're small jokes on you I still need help opening jars <sighs> what do I wear pink no oh what do I do with strapless no, screw it. I'll wear jeans and make a statement. <laughs> no, that's lame. Ah, everyone's gonna hate you. I wanna die. It's funny how the girls who look good in everything are gonna be throwing this fit in their closet every time they get ready. <laughs> Cheating on me. She really did wear her legs. You lost thigh touching privileges. Is it bad that my boyfriend has done this to me because I'm the one driving and I grab his leg and he just moved them. And I'm like, okay, your loss. 
If you're a boy, keep scrolling. Go away. Nothing for you here. Just scroll. Girls, do you ever just, you know... I waited that whole time to see her drink some cranberry sauce? What was that? What? I don't get it. Yeah, that's cranberry juice. I don't know, girls. Do you just, just chug a whole thing of cranberry juice? I've never bought that in my entire life. What is the significance? Is it the equivalent of pineapple juice to guys? <laughs> I'm gonna look up cranberry juice. Why? Oh, that was easy. Now I know why. Good to know. My mom watches these videos. Hello friends, it's me. And today we are watching some TikToks that only girls are supposed to understand. So me being a girl, we gonna see if I understand these. Now that the boys are here, pay attention. Girls, let's confuse the guys. Sneezy, sneezy, achoo. Wait, what happened when she sneezed? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, do I really gotta explain this? Sometimes when you sneeze, it feel like a volcano has erupted in your pants. <laughs> You gotta get up and make sure there was nothing there. Or you gotta like touch it, make sure it's not wet. <laughs> no cap in here. You know, actually, here's a hack. Whenever you're about to sneeze, like cross your legs. I don't care if you're standing, sitting, crouching, or cartwheeling. Cross your legs. It helps, I think. What I thought being one of the boys would be like, what is actually? <laughs> What it's actually like? Yeah. Man, they're ruthless. You thought we would go easy on you? Nah, you one of the boys now. No special treatment. Oh, don't even get me started about the roasting. You gonna be cooking like a Costco rotisserie. Literally no one. Me forgetting I'm in public. Yeah! Sometimes I'll just be sitting here recording a video on my computer and I just... Ugh. The best is when you're wearing like a hoodie and then you just like go on and under. It's a warm sack of fat. What's not to like? Only girls know how good this is. I'm scared. Um, actually, when I was a kid, I heard a story about somebody like getting hurt with this, and I stayed the heck away from them. Whoever made this TikTok go to jail. Mom's talking to their daughters like, I get home, those dishes better be done, and I want you to do the laundry and mop the floors and repaint the entire house. Do I make myself clear? Hi, baby. Did you eat today? Oh, my baby. <laughs> I'm gonna send you $200, okay? Go get a sandwich. Let me know when you're on your way home so I can run you a bath, okay? Love you. Y'all baby them too much, and it's funny. This is exactly how my mom is. Mom's gotta stop doing this. Y'all spoil these boys rotten. Like, some just get babied so hard. Honestly, I don't get what all the hype is about. Let's confuse the boys! <laughs> you know, if I didn't hear the crying in the background, I probably wouldn't have realized what this was. But it's like, when that time of the month comes unexpectedly, and you don't have anything for it, just roll up a bunch of toilet paper. A temporary but necessary solution. Walking out of the bathroom after putting a new pad on. Hey, you got a bag of chips in your pants? That new pad be hitting crispy. That really is a TikTok for everything, huh? <laughs> Top 10 gross things girls do and won't admit. I'm not looking forward to her exposing us. Wear the same bra for a week or more without wash. Okay, let me tell you, when I got my first bra, I kept it on 24 seven. I only take it off to take a shower and then it goes on. I would sleep in it. I wore it for maybe six several months and then my mom was like you never wash it and then I'm like I'm supposed to wash it I don't want to and I know that's nasty but I didn't think it was nasty back then we just gonna sit here and be nasty okay leave hair strands in the shower where else are you supposed to put them like they either go down the drain and when they don't go down the drain like you get a clump of hair in your hand after washing your hair you just the shower wall no big deal only shave what's visible check their toilet paper after they wipe isn't this everybody i think everybody checks their toilet paper after they wipe you don't want to look you don't want to see i mean it's your business i feel like everyone does this smash like if you do this no shame everybody does it right nobody that one girl when she wears leggings to school <laughs> literally how my friends see me. This is how I walk to them. <laughs> Leave me alone. This is why I don't get up to sharpen my pencil. 
When you're itchy and forget you have mascara on, oh, or eyelashes, or just anything on your eye is off limits. I've learned to just not touch my face, not touch my eyes, so my nose. I always have to touch my nose because it's itchy. My eyes is a no-go. Also, we can't be touching our face anymore. But yeah, it's just very unpleasant. You got any kind of eye makeup on, you touch your eye and it just goes skirt ruined at the scratch of an itch. Boys, when they get belly fat, oh, they work out. Girls, when they get belly fat. <laughs> Oh, so we going there. I can't speak for all girls, but guilty as charged. I want to know who told him, who snitched. One of y'all ain't loyal. Sharing our secrets with the boys. High-waisted ain't just cute, practical. <laughs> Only girls will understand. Drooling emoji, drool. What? A bumpy road? I mean, yeah, these are fun. I love these, especially if it's like super bumpy and like it feels like my, my car is gonna like lift off and I'm gonna catch some air and I feel like I'm in GTA for a half second, but is there another reason why you're drooling? Um, what am I missing? Care to comment? Only girls will know. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, change the settings to the harder settings. It feels really good on your back. If you have back pains, it's mwah, chef's kiss. However, it does not feel very good on your face. Please tell me I'm not the only one that does this when I get ready. Straightener, shirt. Oh man, I thought I was smart doing this. I thought this was my hack. I thought I invented this, but here we are, everybody doing this. I never ironed a whole entire shirt like that. Wrinkles in my clothes don't usually bother me. I don't care. But if there is an especially nasty one, I will bust out the hair straightener and just like smooth it down. So easy. Oh, this is a nail problem. See, you gotta use this part, but I don't use this part. No, I, I risk it all. I do it with my nail. You can use your nail to do everyday things like that that require your fingers, but like you just have to be gentle. And when you're not gentle, you get hurt. And boy, it really does hurt. This is a pain a lot of people don't understand. When you have like acrylics on and then you just like something hard, that, oh, top 10 pains imaginable. Second to the pain of existing. <laughs> Things girls do in the shower, part two. Okay, these are really risky. <laughs> okay, practice TikTok dances. Sit on the floor and cry. Yeah, <laughs> that's the one. Do absolutely nothing for 30 minutes. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that's a good one. TikToks? No, absolutely not. I don't practice them. The only time I ever practice TikToks is when y'all see me humiliate myself. I have zero patience and zero coordination. Skirt. Ladies, let's confuse the guys. Oh, I know what exactly what she's doing. I think it's hilarious that someone's watching this right now and it's like, wait, what did she do? What did she get out of her bag? Where did she go? So in school, when you don't want boys to see, you just like sneak in. Whatever you're trying to hide, you put it up your sleeve. Very sneaky, you see. And then off to the bathroom you go and nobody will know. <laughs> you know, it's kind of funny. I think it's wild that girls will like go out of their way to make it seem like periods don't exist. Girls, let's confuse the boys. Uh, so you mad at him? Okay, her legs were like this. She went like, skirt. Bro, he's driving a stick shift. Leave him alone. You can't get mad at him for that. She's upset he's spaghetti that he won't grab her leg while he's driving. Y'all trying to go skirt off the road? Like, get you a man that drive an automatic then. Fluffy blankets. Jealousy. Let's confuse the boys, part five. Oh, it's a chair, one of those chairs. I know instantly. Yep, that, yeah, mm-hmm. You know, there's actually a shoulder length hair or longer problem. Because when you sit on these chairs, your hair, I don't know, like it's getting brainwashed or something. It just decides to wrap around the little nails like this. And then when you get up, it's like, whenever we sit on these, we losing some hair. Pain that girls go through. Right, I never burn my head, I burn my hand. So like when you straighten your hair and then you touch it right after and it's really hot, that's how you do it. That hurts. Oh, hitting the nails against something, yes. That's what I was talking about. Cramps, I feel like if you get cramps, you need like at least one day off a month. Unnecessary pain, yes, I will be in bed the rest of the day. It ain't even fair. How a ooh girl dries her hair, oh so gentle. How a bruh girl dries her hair. <laughs> hey, I actually never thought about doing it that way. That's pretty good. I just braid it overnight and wait for it to dry. But when I wake up, it's still wet. It's just a waiting game with me. Can you just check if everything's okay? Thanks. Yeah, everything's fine. There's nothing there. You're good. Oh, the little check me. You know, I feel like it's always a feeling. Like, you feel like there's a stain, there is a leak. <laughs> there is something there, but 99.9% .9 of the time, there is nothing but you and your imagination. 
Things girls do in the shower. Oh no. Oh, make fake YouTube videos. Fake arguments that you plan but never say. Perform for no one. Check to make sure there's no killer. Okay, you know what? I thought this was gonna be inappropriate, but man, I do enough videos. Last place I need to do a video is in the shower. I'm scared the shampoo bottles are gonna see me embarrass myself. Trying to fake an argument. Yeah, that, that goes on in my head. It stays in here. When I'm in the house by myself, I gotta check every inch of the house to make sure there's no killer. When I tell you this man is so fine, when I tell you this man is scrump dilly issues, he make me wanna. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, Let me tell you, I've never related so much to a TikTok. Scrump dilly issues. The way she just. Girl, you good? You okay? Only anime guys really got me acting like that. Normal girls, okay? Doing my mascara. All right. Psycho girls. Oh, it took me a sec. I'm like, wait, what is she doing different? Is there something with a technique? She did her mascara. With her mouth closed. I don't know how people do that. And then I saw somebody have the audacity to say, but, 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 but it doesn't make a difference whether you open your mouth or not. No, it, it does. It really does. Like when you open your mouth, it like pulls the skin so you have like less of a chance of getting the mascara on your face. It's better, okay? It is a scientifically proven advantage to mascara application. You can't tell me otherwise. When you think it's red, but it's actually, oh no, go to jail. Or maybe I should go to jail. Is that what I think it means? That's illegal. Y'all getting way too comfortable on this app. How I see myself. I, and then change. How my mom sees me. Ugh. How my friends see me. Um, I beg to differ. My mom sees me how my friends see me. Skinny! She always trying to feed me. I mean, I guess that's a good thing because I like to eat.